Hey guys, Marshall One here, and today I'll be playing with HK MP5K. It's a CR weapon from Weapon Set One, and if you're curious about weapon stats, well, you may check them from the right side on your screen because I think it's much and way better to read that than to listen to me talking. Anyway, why I've decided to play with this weapon? Well, because I wanna show you guys that it's possible to play even with weapons from Weapon Set 1 and I think uh, generally many of you forgot that uh, weapons from Weapon Set 1 are really better weapons than some of them in weapon set 5 and I think you guys been thinking that as you proceed and as you level up or if a weapon is more expensive that it's better or it's worth getting well today uh, I will show you how MP5K fully custom is working I'm using a camper XL on it and I'm using my favorite Osprey silencer also all that with and 15 tactical device just to improve my uh, accuracy but yes I have on my mind that it will reduce my mobility so uh, till the end of this video probably you will uh, get a different view and see how this weapon behave exactly when you use it properly uh, I'm not saying that I'm really good with this one but believe me uh, the more you play with CR weapons uh, the better you get simply you get used to it and I'm not the guy who likes switching a lot because like that you are uh, losing your accuracy you are losing your feeling about uh, handling the weapons properly and you could see that I'm also using Desert Eagle custom but uh, I don't have it fully custom but simply you now wonder why I have it well simply for me it's really good for long shots and keeping my distance between you see, keeping my distance between the enemies because uh, when you have not that powerful weapon uh, in your set then you wanna keep your distance really and have in mind this one is good for rushing but it's not uh, that great for doing high kill streaks uh, in case that you are really professional in this game I'm not saying that I am and probably you will see how I'm doing with it uh, but I wanna remind you that I've been already playing this uh, with this weapon since I really have it fully custom so don't think that I've been paying for this one and I really recommend you to just go on and play let me you will finish it really hard last weapon uh, last meta level were around 75k experience so uh, you will have no problems completing even a weapon task I mean it's ridiculous before we had to do five triple kills now it's nothing so just compare how how hard it was to do uh, triple kills with this weapon but anyway what I'm trying to do because I've seen someone been asking for KAC custom oh double headshot oh my god uh, and I've been thinking like uh, to show you guys how those newbie weapons are working and I really hope and I'm trying to give my best uh, to help those newbie players who are just starting and they are thinking like what weapon should I take to play well since you cannot go on hardcore but here I wanna present you how this weapon could work exactly without uh, proper skills or at least basic skills but of course on hardcore you know everyone is dying in few bullets but I want to tell you that if you use properly this weapon and of course with uh, sight on it then you may have I mean you will now not have um, problems doing uh, long shots or aiming for hashes anyway I'm a little bit lagging that, that's why I stopped talking for, for a second so I think that that was something about that I've been talking previously in my videos a lag, a lag and bugs and glitches so I think it's because of it and I'm really curious about those new guys who will be using this weapon I, I simply like to go around YouTube type uh, to see new videos that I that are posted daily just in case to see what weapons are used the most and I'm really happy when I see those 
guys who just started to play Contract Wars are using those weapons and that's what gave me inspiration to try and present you how this one is working but I hardly believe developers will be working to improve uh, accuracy of this weapon more and more and I believe if I'm not really wrong that uh, thank you during the upcoming update they will really improve uh, maybe stats of this weapon because they started to improve uh, weapons that haven't been good in, in past so I believe really they will improve this one so probably you guys wonder now should you customize this one or not well if you're low level and you just started or you're level under 59 well definitely you know what I, I will do like I will go uh, one by one set I, I will simply go to unlock each set just to have all weapons then I will be customizing uh, weapons that are in weapon set 1 because they require less experience you see it's simple to do long shots so why don't you give a try I mean if you wonder how you can collect fast experience there you go you have a hardcore so you can play it. and believe me you will you will simply level up faster doing everything here faster but I think so far I'm doing really so good with this one I simply don't care about who will I kill the most guy piece I just wanna do kills guys you know just to present you how this one is working and I hope I really hope you are having fun so far watching me and as you can notice recoil isn't that high again it's simply amazing. By my opinion, uh, for mid-range maps or close combat, I think this one is far way better than K, C, P, D, W. I think it's cool like that, or let's just call it K, C, custom. But, I don't know. In my opinion, I think both are, are worth unbreaking and they are so expensive. I think for this one you will pay only 50 GP, for Kether you will pay 25 or 15. I'm really not sure because it was a long time when I unbroke it. I know when I just started that my first weapon that I unbroke were KC. In that time it was really hard to task weapon because of that uh, flash that's coming out from the... I don't know how to call this <laughs> fucking shit from the pipe <laughs> so I, I really had a hard time tasking it but I believe developers are doing their best job to help you guys out uh, and help newbies simply to feel better and to be able to compare to some other guys who are playing already this game for a longer time so I think I'm really having a great time going back to my first weapons and bringing back my memories because you know we all used to play with those guns and I'm just a little bit uh, sad that you guys haven't had a chance to try this one before and to see how it was looking before and what all you should do just to finish a weapon task I mean it was amazing I remember the time when you needed for some guns like 50 to 100 pro kills to complete the weapon task you know how much is it and I see you guys today comp complain about hey I need oh my god stupid bugs in contract force and I see guys today complain about storm kills. I mean, get real, guys. It's nothing. I think. Oh yes. Uh, I'm really curious if I killed a single VIP today with this one or not. Uh, I know. I know. I I've been doing. Uh, previously with MPX so many long shots and I believe this weapon is exactly the same I mean just 
compare when I aim down the sight with this one and with MPX that those weapons are really similar but MPX is just way stronger and more powerful for killing your enemies but um, I have a feeling that this weapon is jumping I mean kicking a little bit more than a MPX you know oh I'm doing good so for CR weapon, if you're gonna compare it to GP weapon, I think it's not a big difference between this one and MPX, so uh, I really don't see a reason why some guys uh, would give that much GP to get uh, MPX when you can unbreak it, this one for really really low price, even if you wanna pay it will cost you like 10 GP per meta level I'm not sure the price of the last one but I know I know it took me like a day to fully customize this weapon because it's so easy it's ridiculous how easy it is and at the start you will see you will have a lot of problems um, grinding those meta levels because uh, it, it, it's not accurate at the start simply you need a proper attachments for it to aim better to be stronger and yes I will tell you exactly if you remove the Osprey silencer you will gain bonus for killing players on distance so just give it a try guys I, I hope really after watching this video a uh, few you will go and try it and I will be happy to see you here on site or maybe around the Contract Wars maps trying this one and that will tell me that you simply been following my videos and that I was the one who who gave you like ideas what should you try because you know these days when I'm bored I really wanna test new weapons I mean old one but for me it's totally a new so few more kills and that's it I'm really sad that I haven't killed any VIP in this match but it's not a problem. Anyway, I really hope you had fun watching this so you can decide what you should do with this one. But I really believe you will go on and try this one. Anyway, thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed and if you want you can support me with like button or subscribe down there for more daily videos. Stay positive and as always, enjoy.